Hi everyone and welcome to the summer crash course of innovation and design. My name is Miss Reyna and I work in the elementary school at AISG as the elementary innovation coach. In today's video, we'll be looking at an overview of the course, some of the learning objectives, and I'll be explaining your tasks for today. Let's get started. All right, first up, let's have a look at the course overview. This class will be broken into six parts where you will be introduced to design ideas and concepts, apply this thinking in a creative way to a real world scenario, and finally sharing a final presentation for a project that you choose. I hope you'll find this work as exciting as I do and that you'll try something new, whether it be a new way of thinking or a new tool or website that you can use later on. Our first lesson today will focus on the theme of introductions. This will include introductions to one another as classmates and teacher, an introduction to your creative personality, and an introduction to the concepts of design and innovation. Here are your tasks for today. Your first task is to complete the student survey that I've created and posted in the content library of our class notebook. This survey will ask you what you prefer to be called, what device or devices you'll have access to during this course, where you are right now, and if you are located within China, whether you have a VPN or not. It will also ask you to upload a selfie, so be prepared for that. Your second task today is to complete the Adobe Creative Personality Quiz. This quiz is just for fun, but it's a nice introduction to creativity and its link to design. The link for this quiz can be found as well in the content library of our class notebook under today's lesson. Once you have taken the quiz, please read your results carefully. Do you agree with what it says about you? Post your results in the reflection section of the class notebook under your name. The third task for today is to introduce yourself on Flipgrid. If you have never used Flipgrid before, it's very easy. All you need to know is that you will need your Microsoft AISG email and password to log in. You will press the green record button. You can delete, pause, re-record, or upload until you have a video that you're happy with. I will post an example video there in case you need help or inspiration. And finally, your fourth and last task for today is to go off in search of some answers to these two questions. Number one, what does it mean to be a designer? And number two, what makes something innovative? You will post your answers to these two questions in the reflection section of the class notebook under your name. Good luck, and if you have any questions, please reach out to me in the Teams chat or send me an email at rlazarou at aisgz.org. Bye.